Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Terra Nova and today I am bringing you episode number 14 of The Sims 3 Clone Challenge. So yeah, look at Emma's face. She is not impressed and uh, it's totally understandable. I mean, she's about to go and take her final exams, the last ones she will ever need for this degree, her communications degree. And uh, yeah, well, she's not a about to go take them. She has them in four hours. She's about to go to the fridge. <laughs> so uh, let's just uh, follow her over there. Um, she's still not happy. <laughs> she's just like, why are you making me do this? All right, so it looks like she's also starting to feel a bit ill. So um, that's probably my fault. I'm sure she had some like, I don't know, gross food. No, that would make her throw up. I don't know. <laughs> okay. So, I'm just going to have her speed through this because we have a lot to do in this episode. And I want to make sure we have time to finish it because I don't know about you, but I'm, I'm sick of her being in university. I want her to go home and live in the beautiful house that I made for her when I first planned this challenge. <laughs> so, alright. What, what do we have here? Three hours left? Okay, why don't you... Um... Read, study, study, study from this book, okay? Raise your uh, school academic level before you have to go take your final. This is finals cramming. All right, can we put the walls up so I can take a cute picture of you studying like a good student? Okay. And now I'm gonna put the walls back down. Oh gosh, that rain in the game is so loud. <sighs> Anyways, um, oh shoot, she's gonna be late. Go to class. Go to class. And we're going to, can we try hard? That's gonna ruin her fun levels and her energy levels, but that's okay. All right. Oops, okay. Now go take your test. Do really well in it. I think she has two of them today. Yep, she has one at four o'clock too. So we actually have time to bring her home and uh, take care of her needs for a little bit before her next one. I do believe. Maybe not. Yeah, probably not. It's already two. <laughs> All right. Leonard Shelley invited Emma Duvon to an upcoming bonfire. Um, and she nailed the coursework on Life Science 202 exam and passed with flying colors. Yay. Um, what do I want to do? I want her to eat an apple. She probably won't go to that party Leonard Shelley is having because I kind of want our house and uh, our housemates to have a party themselves tonight because it's their last night being roommates together in university. So uh, why not have a little fun, right? <laughs> okay, so we're going to fast forward this again. She's going to try hard, and it looks like she made the dean's list. That's cool. Um, academics. And her academic bar is all the way at the top, too. So she should do great and pass with flying colors on this exam, too. So, Joni? Okay. I don't know. I just like seeing Sims names as they pass by. All right. Little faster. We'll do quadruple speed. Because that's how impatient I am about this. We have a lot to do tonight. We have to celebrate with Garrison and Sharon. Even though I'm pretty sure both of them are already graduated. So I don't know. What does she want to do? She wants to play hopscotch with Garrison? Um, Don't go to Leonard Shelley's party. And she nailed that exam too. I'm glad you are coming to class, Emma. If you put in some extra effort, you could really succeed. Um, We did. <laughs> we already did that. Why don't you go home? Don't talk to this girl, Tiffany Rich. Just go home, Emma. And we'll throw our own party and have a ton of fun. She's really tired, though, so I might just make her drink a ton of coffee. If I'm being completely honest. And look at this. This police car is still here. I think it's just this lot that's bugged. But at least the couch isn't ringing anymore, right? <laughs> Where are you going, Sharon? Come back. Stop coming home. Just do what I tell you to, please. Alright, Garrison's out here too? Oh, jeez. Alright. Well, just 
can we throw throw a party when you're done with all of that? Hey, there's a letter for for Sharon from Ashley De Sorrento. It says I've been too shy to say it in person, but I really care about you a lot. Do you feel the same for me? Oh my gosh. Ashley was our roommate when we were in the dorm. And now she's hitting on our roommate. Oh, we got a party to plan. We are going to have a juice kegger. Right? Yeah, that's the one I want. We'll have it for 9 p.m. Dress code casual. Um, friends and neighbors. They're all guys. Don't we have any girls that are friends? Um, no, we don't want to invite the professor. No. None of these are other... I don't think anyone else is a professor. We'll invite Nina. Alright. We'll invite Ashley so that she can have a chance to hit on, uh, <laughs> our roommate. <laughs> um, who else do we want to invite? I think that's it. Oh, we'll invite Tiffany. We talked to her earlier today, so it's the only nice thing to do. I'm gonna pause this. It says buy a buffet table. Uh, probably not. Um, but yeah. So Emma's juice kegger is starting soon. Gosh, I can't talk. <laughs> Make sure to have the keg filled and music blasting when guests arrive. Hey, there's a letter for Emma from Hank McElmore. It says, okay, keep an open mind for a sec while I paint a picture for you. You a picture, whatever, which way. You meet together. How does that make you feel? Grossed out because we have a boyfriend and it's serious. Seriously. <laughs> okay, so um, this is gross and I'm going to put this outside. The music is on and we will refill the keg right now. Um, where's Garrison? He's still here, right? Yes. Okay. So we planned a party. And look at all the leaf piles we can jump into. That is going to be fun. I'm going to move these clothes into the hampers so they aren't in our way anymore. And I am going to lock for... Unlock? Oh, okay. So it must already be locked for all of our guests. What do you have there? Why are you carrying garbage around? Oh, no, she threw away the leaf piles. Those were supposed to be... Ugh, Emma, those were supposed to be for the party. Okay. Pause this. Um, I want you to have a cup of this coffee that was from, like, the day we moved in. The first guests have arrived, and it's time to start the party. To make sure... To make it a success, make sure everyone is having a good time. Um, that'll be fine. Are you gonna drink that, Emma? Emma? Are you gonna drink the coffee? Only one day left until the term ends. Now that finals are over, it's time to kick back and relax, say goodbye to friends, and have a little fun. That's why we're having this party. Drink something. Is that what I had to do this whole time, or is she gonna brew another one? She is. Ah. <sighs> Oh, I could have had her have something else then. Oh, that's gross. Okay. Um, we'll go over here down to where the party's at. Oh, look at they're doing a keg stand. Stefan and Hank. Oh, we invited Hank. After he hit on us. Oops. <laughs> um, can we call these people over to where we're at? No, we'll just go over here. Emma, please come over here and... Um, poor juice. Change to... Oh, that's fine. And then play Juice Pong with... With, with, with... We'll play Juice Pong with Sharon. Alright, where are you at? She's coming to have her juice? She's gonna, gonna have juice? <laughs> I stumbled over my words so bad right there. Okay. Um, is this guy in our way? Stefan? back knee? I didn't even read it. Why is everyone just crying? What's wrong, Alfred? What is wrong? Poor guy. He looks so sad. <laughs> Not really. He just looks the same as always. Um, where is everyone else? He's sleeping. He's a great joy to the party. This party is not going to be exic- The blah, blah, blah. <laughs> this party is not going to be a success. But whatever. Um, why don't you come here and play juice pong with Leonard Shelley? Did he show up? 
he gonna come over here? Oh, he is. Okay. So he did show up to our party, and I bet that's him calling right now, saying he missed us at his, his party. Oh. Leonard, what are we gonna do with you? Okay, well, we have seen this before, so I'm just gonna double speed it. Um, Here, people are starting to come in here now. I wish I could control Sharon. Oh, she went to bed, too. Garrison and Sharon just left us to party all by ourselves and entertain all these people by ourselves. I bet they're going to make us clean by ourselves in the morning, too. Oh, I knew it. I knew that was going to be Leonard. As the caps fly in the air, Emma Duvans flies slightly higher. She earned a perfect GPA. Yay! Even after failing the first, the first term that she was here. <laughs> Why are you so upset? Dance. I don't care how tired you think you are. You're at a party. You should have fun. Look at her just muscling. Okay, well, you can leave your guests to themselves, I suppose. Come in here and um, use the bathroom. Oh. Well, no point unclogging that. It's just for another day. And then go to sleep. Please. Pretty please. Where are you at? Slowly, ever so slowly. Run upstairs. Into your bedroom. Into your bathroom. Okay, let's see what our guests are doing. We still have the holiday lights up. <sighs> How tacky. Um, holiday house lights? None. That's a little better. Oh, someone was streaking. Who is it? Alfred was streaking? Gosh, we're missing all of the fun parts of the party, except Hank looks a little mad at Leonard because I think Leonard is in his way of the juice kicker. Okay. Resume the shenanigans. Everyone's mad at Leonard. <laughs> Everyone is so upset at him. Except he's mad at Stefan. Brackney. Now Nina is... Now Nina is streaking. Okay. I wish I could make them do fun things. I mean, none of them can get to the keg. None of them are dancing. These two are streaking. That's, I suppose that's fun. Oh, now Stefan is... Now he's streaking. Okay. Well, I think, yeah, Emma is asleep. So I think I will be back in the morning then. Alright, so Emma is um, not fully rested yet, but I'm going to wake her up because this is our last day on campus and I want to get some stuff done. Um, and just to let you know, it may be 7.20 right now, but our last guests didn't leave until 7 a.m. So, <laughs> I don't know, I just think that's ridiculous that the party lasted that long. But anyways, Emma has the want to clean the Bargain John and repair the Broken Bargain John. So we might as well help her with her wishes here. A little faster. Unclog it. And then flush it. Hannah Germana, Germ but whatever. Hannah Germanata wants to know if Emma Duvon would like to go on a date. No. We are in a committed relationship. <laughs> Look at her. She was not happy to be asked that. Okay. Are you going to repair it? Unclog it. <gasps> She's going to receive her report card in the bathroom. Alright. Oh, I didn't pause it in time. Alright, we already knew she got an A. Can I catch this face? I did last time, and I want to this time. Okay. Does it actually show us what the report card showed us? No, it's just a bunch of paper signed by the dean. Okay. Unpause. I don't think she's going to repair that. Way to go, Emma. We're so proud of you. You graduated. Alright. Come down here and eat leftover salad. I'll take care of this. Because that's just gross. Can I throw this away? No. She's going to sit there. Now I can't even put it back on the tray. Okay. Emma, where are you? I look at Garrison sitting there all dressed up on the couch, just reading a book. And uh, Sharon is cleaning. Very cool. 
She is such a good roommate. So much better than those girls at the dorm. They were messy. Like, severely messy. Alright. But once you're done with that, Emma, I would like you to take a bath. The final grades are in for Emma Duvon, and she earned enough credits to complete her degree. Yay! Alright. Oh, and Emma's party was awesome. Verging on Epic and Sims Around Town will be talking about this one for years. So, yeah. Everyone basically... After Emma went to sleep, everyone just started streaking. <laughs> like, literally everyone. And yeah, so I can see how that might have been a fun party for someone. Emma Duvon has a graduation ceremony tomorrow. Invite Emma's friends and family to attend. Invite friends and family! Alright, so we're going to invite Garrison, and we're going to invite Sharon. And that's all we care about. <laughs> uh, and today, I'm going to slow it down here. Today, we're going to spend some time with our lovely friends and family, which would be Garrison and Sharon. <laughs> um, compliment him on his business degree. Be like, hey, we graduated now. We have a degree too. <laughs> compliment him and compliment his appearance because he looks a great since I gave him a makeover. There's no denying that. And then maybe we can play a video game. Can we play with him? Um, let's play some SSX. I don't know what that is. Probably like, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so we're going to double speed this because I'd like to get through this day before the end of the episode. Um, Emma Duvon has done so much social... Social ladder climbing that she can now choose another trait. Oh, that's cool. Um, computer whiz. I'm guessing this is from the, um, nerd influence going up high enough. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Why not? Go for it. Emma Duvon is now a nerd elite within the nerd social group. And, okay. Can we garrison? Pause. Who's that? Sure, I would love to attend your graduation. Um, who the heck are you? Is this? Why can't I see you? I don't get to see her unless she's like. Oh, okay. Oh, Ashley Corono. I don't know who that is. I'm sorry. I don't know who that is. All right. Garrison, I know you're peeing, but join us. Play video games with us. It's the nerdy thing to do. Oh. Alright, so Emma is now level 8 in the um, nerd influence social group. Nerd oh. social group. Whatever. Garrison, are you going to come play video games with us? Aww. Look at this. This picture perfect moment. As soon as he grabs a controller. Yeah, there we go. And she's thinking about computers. Sharon is just being like, yep, I'm reading a book because I don't want to play video games with you two. Alright. Alright. That's adorable. Um, yeah. I, I don't know. Maybe we should do something with Sharon, too. What is there? Oh, we have mail. Alright, get mail. Please, you can stop playing video games now. I know that's going to help your nerd influence, but you don't need to max that up for a while, and we're almost done. So, yeah. Um, she has to get a job that has something to do with her degree first, and then we'll deal with that later. Oh, her graduation ceremony is starting now, but I wanted you to get the mail. Emma! I thought that was tomorrow! <laughs> okay, are they coming with? They better be, I don't think they are. I really don't think they are. How sad is that? There are only friends and family and they aren't even coming with. Maybe I should have invited another clone of Emma. Maybe I should have just put another clone in this university. Just to, uh, I don't know, see if people got messed up. Alright, ooh! Off my desk, please, little girl. 
<laughs> my cat just tipped over my microphone. So, sorry about that. But, onward to graduation. What the heck? Is that a reaction to Cindy? Cindy Hong? Wow. Okay. Alrighty. Oh, look at Emma. She's all in her graduation robes. Let's see if I can get a picture here without people in the way. We'll just zoom in a lot. Look at her. All graduated and stuff. Okay. Zoom out. Zoom way out. There's Hank and he's reeking. Oh, um, um, hey. Looks like Mamu, Mam I can't pronounce it, but he has a very interesting bright yellow hair. Oh, there's another plant sim! Pause! Pause! Who are you? Shay Holtus? Oh my gosh! There's another plant sim, and it's a guy! Can I just have you give him a friendly interaction? Please? I just want him on our list of people we know. Can I make... Oh, there's Sharon. Oh, Sharon came. She did come. Maybe... Oh, I wish I could play her. I want someone in our family to know. No, don't walk away. Oh, they're going in the other door. Oh, and look, Garrison came too. Because he loves us. He wanted to be there for us. Alright. I am going to triple speed this because it's a little annoying. Oh, Sharon's all dressed up. There's just a clog at the door here. Alright. Little faster. Oh, there's the graduation music. Okay. Almost done? Halfway done. There weren't that many people that looked like that were actually graduating, though. Hmm. Oh, that wasn't Sharon. That was... That wasn't Sharon. That wasn't Emma. That was Cherry. Cherry. I don't know. Alright, I just have to make sure I'm focused on Emma when she comes out so I can get a good picture of her. Oh, there's Ashley Corono and she's streaking. <sighs> Alright, a little faster. A little, little faster. Because Emma Duvand earned a degree, she can now choose another trait. Yay! Um, irresistible? No. Um, I don't know. What what should she have? Ambitious would be nice because uh, she really does need to move up the ladder in her careers. Um, yeah, let's let's do ambitious. Okay. Congratulations, graduate. Emma has graduated from university with a degree in communications. Oh, look at her. Look at her. I'm so proud of her. Okay. And we'll push play. Or is she going to throw her hat or whatever? I don't know. I don't know if they do that in The Sims 3. Nope, apparently not. Okay, pause. Untab. I don't think that plant sim came out again. I'm a little upset at that. I really wanted her to meet him. Doesn't look like he's anywhere. Where are you going? Boast about gamer skills? No, don't do that. That's mean. Look at he threw his degree or his diploma. Why didn't Emma do that? Toss diploma! Oh, okay, no. She's gonna enthuse about comic books. Go do that. Oh, there he is! Oh, he graduated too! Send a text to Shay Hollis. We have so much in common. I'd love to get to know you better. Oh, they love each other. They already love each other. But she has a boyfriend. And she's already roommates with a plant sim. Alright. That's fine. That's totally fine. They'll just be friends. Um, She wants to send a text. So let's just uh, interact with him for a little bit. We'll ask how old he is and his sign and his alma mater. Ask if he's single because that's important. We don't want to get our hopes up if he's taken. Oh, but he thinks we're hot. <laughs> and he's a rebel, so that's cool. Yep, we got a rebel influence from him. 
One hour until time to leave for home, wrap up those last minute goodbyes and start thinking about enrolling to come back next term. No, we graduated. He's one day younger than us, that's not bad. It's really not. Oh, there was my timer. Um, he's a Capricorn, nothing special about that. But we should really have Emma go home when she's done talking to him. I don't really care about his alma mater. Because I already know. Okay, he attended Le Fromage Art School. And he has a degree in science and medicine. Very, very cool. Okay, run home before we get kicked out. And he's single! Oh my gosh! Okay, that's cool. That's great to know. He might be coming to visit us back home. <laughs> okay, well, they're gonna kick us out, so why don't you get the mail? Um, it looks like Sharon is already home, and Garrison, I'm sure, is back there still. Okay, well, I'm gonna end the episode here because the timer did go off, and basically all that's left to do is to get kicked out of university and sent back home, which I would like to do in the next episode. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> sorry. Anyways, this was episode number 14 of The Sims 3 Cologne Challenge. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Also, check out my Twitter, which is in the link below. Um, yeah, I post all my new uploads on there and other Sims-related stuff, so you should definitely check it out. But anyways, my name is Terranova, and I hope you all have an absolutely fantastic day. Bye, guys.